Hey guys, welcome back. We're down here at Caleb Russell's Ranch in Florida and we're off to Wild Board GECC. We made it. Round two, Palaka, Florida. Some man live his life for profits alone. That very same man, he lives his life all alone. Getting ready for the interview. Oh, are we rolling? Pulling the road to life, yes, it goes up and down. It doesn't really matter as long as the news he goes on. But Mr. Garland, now why don't you come round? So it's Friday here at the race, we're just hanging out with the crew, me and Ian are matching with our floral shorts. He's got the dope hat though, I custom mine and put a Trail Jesters logo on mine. Refreshing. What do you have to say for the vlog, Tom? yippee i okay. <laughs> Dale! Hey! I heard you have something for me. I do. I absolutely do. This is, this is. Here. Look at this. Check this out. Let's show the people. Oh. Check it out. Check them out. Personal trading cards. Got the QR cards really? on the back. That's what the people want, Dale. I want one. You can get as many as you want. Thanks, brother. Find me at the races for them. I like your shirt. Thanks. Official. Good luck this weekend. Thanks. So right now, uh, just heading out to go cycle the track, just to get the layout figured out, you know, where it goes. Um, not really checking for lines or any bad areas. There's the starting line. So first impressions of the track, it's going to be pretty gnarly. It's going to get really rough, um, just like usual. Um, as you can see here, this is all perfectly smooth. And by our race, there will be three, four foot whoops, not even exaggerating all through this track. That's why they call it the gnarliest race of the year besides snowshoe, but it's for different reasons. It's going to be hot. Three hours out here is going to be crazy. So. I shine in that kind of stuff, and uh, yeah, I mean, being a photo boy, I wouldn't want it any other way. It's already whooped out. It'll never be this nice for the rest of the weekend. Also, I forgot to mention, what do you guys think about the, the shirt, the kit, put the Trail Jester sticker on there. I'm looking legit. Uh, thing that kind of run. I've had some good feedback, some bad feedback, but I figured it's Florida. I'm a Florida boy. It's kind of fitting. Got the floral shirt and everything. It's Friday. The vibes are pretty mellow. Uh, obviously, tomorrow I got to wear the team shirt. Sunday, I got to wear the team shirt, but I'm free to wear whatever I want Friday. I understand it would look stupid if it was anywhere else, but being Florida, it's fitting. I had to do it. Are we rolling? Yeah, we're rolling. Yeah, we're getting ready. I'm locked and loaded with the, the essentials in the backpack. The essentials, you'll see shortly. Where you were planning on doing that? No, when we were just starting his headshots. Yeah. Oh, making a vlog? Making a vlog. He's oh. gonna be in the vlog. What? He's gonna be in the vlog. Video guys. Photo shoot gone wrong. It's all about getting through it. Well, I see the battery thing. This thing, this plug is open. Yeah, you're running 
You're in the vlog. <laughs> Bam. Can't zoom in with my glove on. What's up? Hi, how are you? What's up? prototype though, strictly a prototype. Yeah, that's pretty we'll sweet. Quick change battery system, different size batteries, and they're module batteries, so you'll be able to repair them. Really, anybody can take it apart and repair it in 10, 20 minutes, rather than, you know, like the Alta stack was, had to do a major overhaul to redo the batteries in it, so. That's awesome. Made it simple as possible. XEMX1.com is where we have it. Cool. Awesome, thanks. Yeah, thank you. So we're out here right now, checking out the track for the second time. Um, it got a bit chilly. A little bit of rain came through and it cooled off the weather a lot. So as you can see, I'm in a jacket, a little raincoat, just in case it wants to drizzle again. But um, the pro quads are about to take off now. And I'm just trying to check out the track and see where the good lines and where the bad lines are. Uh, it's Sunday morning and this is why the Florida GNCC is the toughest of them all. Some plan is to jump this ditch because this was just from the youth bikes. Always got this guy up in my face. Picking spots. I'd, I'd have a lot easier time if I didn't have to film this guy. Can you record two devices at once? <laughs> Dang. Look at this guy go. I got skills, buddy. Now I'm starting to have second thoughts about you. You're kind of all right. <laughs> I'm like eighth pick or something. Slack in that first round. It's better than 10th, though. Look up and I'm like, oh, dude, dude you, went, you went full sprint. That one's a little bit deeper than I thought, too, when I was, when I was running through it. Oh. A little bit of water 
waterproofing. All that water out there, I don't want it to uh, splash up underneath my tear offs. Because then your goggles are just junk at that point. How you been? Good, how are you? Good, good to see you. You too. How do you think you're going to do today? Good? Yeah, we're going to do awesome. we're going to do great. I always do great when you show up. There you go. That's how we here. We brought the whole family. That's right. Perfect. Okay. I'm going to Can you just grab it? I'll just eat it out here. You got to tear off this year? I have a bunch. Oh yeah. I got 14 on there today. Huh? Tear offs? Oh, big uh, what do you Oh. Nah. You got the cards, huh? Yeah, we got the cards. You want one? I got to take one to I, I get mine to test. It's like an endless pocket right here. How's the track out there, Jason? It's pretty good. It's a little muddy. What time was up here before when it was really dirty? Yeah, it's not it's not dusty today. I don't know if I'd be going 100 in your dump truck. No, I'm talking about my pickup. Oh, oh yeah. You say you don't need me. You call me good for nothing. A waste of space. Florida GCC, done and dusted. Uh, definitely had better days to say the least. Um, ended up getting sick on lap two and it was basically downhill from there. It was all about survival for me at that point. Um, yeah, it was just something that I really don't ever go through and uh, it sucks that it went, it sucks that it happened here at Florida uh, where I ride my best typically. So uh, I still salvage seven. 7th XE2 and I think 19th overall so yeah I mean it is what it is we got a race next weekend so we just got to regroup and uh, get my body situated and ready to go for the next one some man live his life for profits alone that very same man he lives his life all alone